how to use the contour tool to create interesting text effects in Affinity Designer. Go here to the artistic text tool, create some text. Then go to the contour tool and you can interactively modify the radius so you can increase it by going to the right or decrease it by going to the left. You can also go up here and you can modify the radius by entering a value or using the slider. You can also go to the contour type and you can go for round, which is the default, or you can go for mitre. So click there and you can see now you get this sharp edge effect. You can also modify the mitre value here. And you see as you do that, it changes. It will reach a certain point and it will not change. Caps you can ignore. I'm just going with the auto close here. But you can also go with forced open. Click there. And as soon as you do that, if I just decrease that, you can create interesting outline designs very quickly using that force open. You can also, if you're finished with the contour, you can always bake appearance. Just click that and that will finalize it. But also what you can do, you've got the type selected here. It's a layer. You can go down here, you can apply effects, but you can also go with version two. You've got the option here for the mesh warp. So I'm just going to go with bend vertical. So bend vertical and you can see the result there. At this point, no tool, you can select that and you can modify the value. So let's just increase the value. You can see it warping like that. But you can also at any point go back to the contour tool, select that and then modify that. And you can see the result. You can change it. You can create some interesting designs simply by modifying and tweaking the contour radius as well as using force open or auto close. You can also go over here to the move tool and you can then resize the design. And as you do that, again, some more interesting, unusual effects where the text virtually vanishes, or you can rotate the design and you can see again, the warp and everything changes very quickly. At any point, you can always go to the artistic text tool. So select that, and then you can modify the text. So if you want to, you can put Bob instead. Again, very hard to read. Select some text, then go to the contour tool, and then increase the radius. You can see there in the layers, you've got contour. Just click that. And as soon as you've done that, you'll notice it goes back to the node tool. But what you can do, you can go to the layers, expand this out, and you can select, say, the first curve there, the C. Again, go to the contour tool, and then you can change the contour. So you can reduce that down, maybe create a very thin C. You can select another one, say the T, and repeat that, maybe a thin T or click this one, maybe increase the U. You can also change the contour type. You can also then click here and change a color. And all kinds of different text designs can be created. Hope you found this tutorial of interest. Any questions, please let me know in the comments below. Always great to hear from you. Thank you much.